You don't need some high-end equipment and stuff to like shoot anything. I actually don't know what settings I use. <laughs> I just kind of turn it on and it is what it is. I have no interest in like your know, technical aspects really. I don't even know what lens this is or what like specific stuff it does. It's all like emotional and like intuitive and stuff like that. I'm Matty Brown and I'm a filmmaker. I started making these films with the smallest, cheapest equipment. I started learning these like you know, techniques and how to tell stories with just emotion. And I'm here just to kind of explain how experimenting with stuff can really just evolve your craft. And the more you make and the more you like experiment, the more you'll become successful at what you want to do. This uh, class is called Experimenting with Short Film. Today we're going to be doing this project and trying to create an emotion with seemingly random like, images. What I'm hoping that people will you know, take away from this is that they learn to be free with their camera, harnessing the emotion of your project and shooting for that. And the third thing is to edit you creatively. And I think people should take this class solely for the reason of like forcing themselves to like think creatively on the spot. Just going and experimenting with a bunch of different shots and kind of seeing things differently. Who, who really cares if you mess up? Because no one's gonna see it but you in the editing room, you know? And who knows, maybe that like mistake will actually turn out to be something really awesome. I think the people who would benefit the most from this class are probably the people I was just like a few years ago. Like novices and people who are really trying to you know, break into it and understand it and intimidated by it. Because it is a, like a really intimidating thing. It's like you're competitive. And I hope that this like inspires some people to like you go out there and just shoot everything they see, just edit everything they shoot, you know, create awesome stuff. And if it fails, I mean, that's just part of the like step upward to the next cooler thing that's gonna make them like a Vimeo staff pick or on some cool blog or whatever. I mean, because you never know who will see it in the end, you know? A anyone can take this class. You can use any kind of camera equipment you have, even just your iPhone to go out and shoot a lot of stuff because it is just a trip to the coffee shop or a trip around the block. I think the hardest part of this class that people will probably get stuck on, which I get stuck on every time I shoot, is finding the like inspiration. You go out and you can't find that inspiration, that theme, that thing that's gonna like pump you up. And it's just kind of getting over that hump and just keep shooting through it, keep feeling the space out, keep like understanding what's going on around you and not letting that like optimism fade. That's the most tricky part of I think any shoot really. What I would love to see people make, it's not even really seeing it, but like feeling I want to be moved. Whether it's shot well or or not, it's all about how you make people feel afterwards, which is going to be the be like the biggest like you know, piece of the whole thing. I want people to take away from this class and not just motivated but inspired to go out and like, shoot a bunch of stuff. Um, and so I think we should just go out and do it.